Hi guys, Jennifer here from Beauty is Virtue, and I have some gift tags to show you for Tamika's Shaped Tag Gift Swap. And I created six of them. One will be for Tamika. We had to create five, and then the sixth one would be for us, or I decided to give it to Tamika, uh, because it takes a lot of time and effort to put together these swaps, and I just want to show her that she is very much appreciated for doing this because they are a lot of fun. You get to meet different people and you get to show your work and share it with others. So thank you, Tamika, for doing this. And I want to show you what I created. I created kind of a vintage um, Paris theme elegant um, tag. So basically, I started with this background shape and it is a thinlet from Stampin' Up! and I basically um, cut it out uh, using I think it's the lightweight chipboard and then I backed it with black cardstock on both sides textured cardstock and I stamped this elegant ladies stamp and put uh, embossing powder on it so you can kind of see the um, you know the effect from the embossing powder to just to give it an elegant and a background elegance and a background and some texture and what I did with this is the scissor I used the Sizzix um, the Sizzix die for the Eiffel Tower and I used the lightweight chipboard and I had a napkin that that looked like this and it was a very vintagey color so it was a little difficult to work with the napkin because it's very thin so you have to put on a very thin layer of Mod Podge and I did both sides of the Eiffel Tower because I like things that are finished like that and I ran the napkin through the Sizzix die as well. So I have the lightweight chipboard and then two pieces of napkin on both sides. Well, two pieces total, one on each side. So then I used some little bit of Distress ink to kind of brown it up a little bit. And I think that was Vint... Uh, Antique. No, I'm not sure. It's the darker brown one. Anyway, I put some Distress Stickles in this bronzy color around the edge. It's a little bit of bling here, a small flower cluster, and some... Oh, what is that? Stickles? It's like the clear stickles. Probably can't see that. I'm not sure. But anyway, I, I added... Oops. You didn't see that. Anyway, I added a little bead here and some pieces of, of uh, trim, a little curly from one of the stems, and then three little flowers there. And this to from is a punch and stamp from Stampin' Up. And then I just added a little bit of lace so that they can tie their tag onto a gift. So that's basically my tag. And then I used, to package it, I used the Everyday Vintage Love Letter Kit from Prima. It has really pretty papers in there. And I thought it looked really nice with the tag because of the colors and everything. And it, um, I didn't adhere it to this piece of uh, paper because I wanted them to be able to use that and the tag without ripping the paper. So it seems to stand in there just nicely. And then just a little gift for each person. I made one of my little shabby bows and has a little heart center in there. So I just attached that in a little baggie on the back. So I hope that the girls, whoops, I hope the girls like what I made them. And that they will use it and I hope that you guys enjoyed my little tags 
And thank you for watching. I hope you have an awesome day. All right, guys. Take care. Bye-bye.